Zach with Josh's Frogs, and today we're going to be talking about humidity. Humidity can be thought of simply the amount of water vapor in the air. It can be very important to the well-being of your reptile and amphibian pet. There are three basic ways to control the humidity in your terrarium. They are misting, water features, and substrates. The first class of products to help control humidity in your terrarium or vivarium would be through misting. Misting can be done in two basic ways, through hand-powered misting, such as these pump bottles that we sell at joshesfrogs.com, or through automatic misting units, such as this right here. At joshesfrogs.com, we carry the Mist King brand of automatic misting systems. Known for its high quality and economic price, the Mist King system uses a water reservoir, pump, timer, and misting heads to ensure reliable, pre-programmable misting to meet your animal's needs. The other class of products that Josh's Frogs carries to help meet the humidity needs of your animal are water features. They can be as simple as just a water bowl or water in your tank that will help raise the humidity and give the animal access to fresh water it needs in case of shed and things of that nature to drink from. Either automatic fogging, such as these little handy automatic foggers that are perfectly safe to use in your terrarium as long as the animal cannot come in direct contact with this little doodad unit right here. Then waterfalls are another option too. Not only do they look nice, but they create some humidity as well as water movement that a lot of animals, and especially rainforest type animals, will utilize to thrive. Third class of products to help maintain the humidity in your terrarium or vivarium would be substrates. Things such as coconut bark, moss, um, cypress mulch, things of that nature will actually hold some water and slowly release it over time, thus adding to the general humidity of the tank. It also will provide a humid microclimate towards the bottom of your tank that your animal can burrow in to utilize, depending you know, on what you have. Please also keep in mind that any water in a standing false bottom in a frog vivarium or the like will contribute to the overall humidity of the tank as well. Now that we've gone over some basic methods of controlling the humidity in your terrarium, it's important to keep in mind that it needs to be monitored to ensure that the humidity doesn't fall too low or rise too high above your animal's needs. An easy way to do that would be with a digital hygrometer. Josh's Frogs carries the Exoterra digital hygrometer and thermometer, which has a base unit and then a remote probe that goes into your enclosure to keep track of the humidity and the temperature, which displays in this little digital readout. This concludes today's discussion on humidity in your animal's terrarium or vivarium. For any questions, comments, or to purchase any of the products you saw today on the video, please visit www.joshesfrogs.com.